today's video i'm going to show you how to boost your fps and get zero delay of your mouse and keyboard in fortnite chapter 3 with your any low end pc or laptop so guys make sure to watch my this whole video so let's go straight into over this video so first of all guys you need to download this fortnite fps boost pack on your pc link available down in the description so open up the website from the description link down there of my this video and that will take you here and there you will find out guys the same thumbnail article onto my this website i will upload after this video so there you will find out that article you need to simply guys open up that post which is available here with the same thumbnail of my this recent video you need to click on that article and that will take you here onto this next page now you need to scroll all the way down and there you will find out here this button like click here to start download and you can simply download this pack on your computer so guys once you after downloading this pack you will go to here this kind of the folder so you need to simply open up this file and guys here you will go to these three files inside this fortnite fps boost pack so first of all guys you need to go for this latency monitor exe file double click here click next and simply install the software on your computer click here on the next again check mark onto the create a desktop shortcut click next again and install the software on your pc here you will go to this kind of guys exe file on your desktop you need to click on the finish button and here you will go to this kind of the interface of the software now go for this option and click here on the start monitoring option and it will start launch the software on your computer once you guys launch this application on your computer now you need to simply minimize it and let's go for our next step and then we will guys get back here on to this file now let's go for our next file that is the msi utility variant 2 so you need to double click here double click here again on this xv file and again simply guys open up the software and here you will go this kind of the error but guys don't worry you need to simply drag this file here into your directory of your boost pack and make sure to run this as administrator and here you will go this kind of the interface so once you are here you need to click here on this refresh button one time and now you need to find out here your gpu model or your gpu model name so here you will find out your gpu model name like i have nvidia geforce rtx 3070 you will find out the same exactly like your gpu so click here go for this option which is the msi and make sure to check mark this box by default it is check mark here on my pc now go for this next interrupt priority option and guys click on this drop down go for the high and hit apply and guys here we are done with our msi mod utility now close out the software and here is our last step that is interrupt affinity policy tool and this is the one of the best tool for boosting your fps and reducing the delay of your mouse and keyboard so open up this zip file simply double click here and drag all of these files here on your desktop you will got all these three files now you need to guys open up the file according to your uh, windows so i have 64 bit windows so i will go with the x64 bit and if you have the 32 bit so go with the x86 bit but most people go with the uh, interrupt policy x64 bit right click here and make sure to run this as administrator so guys here you will go this kind of the interface with your this software now what you need to do now you need to find out the name of your gpu model again into this list there is two method guys find it guys randomly manually here or you can simply press uh, the first letter of your gpu like if you have the amd so you will press a from your keyboard and if you have the nvidia so you will press n from your keyboard you will go this kind of the error so guys completely uh, forget it it is guys just fake error click close and there you will find out your gpu model like i have geforce rtx 3070 now go for the guys option which is interrupt affinity mask click here on the set mask option and here you will go this whole list on your pc so guys now what you need to do here guys first of all go for your uh, task bar right click here go into the task manager now go for the performance option and there you will find out guys this kind of the detail i have 10 cores on my uh, this cpu and here is my logical thread which is the uh, 16 and you can also guys find out here i have 16 thread or logical guys cores on my uh, this software also so now what you need to do you need to guys find out the cores of your cpu not the uh, logical processor so how you can find out it so guys here you can check it out here simply like the cpu 0 is your uh, core then here is cpu 2 this is also your core then cpu 4 this is your core then cpu 6 this is your core and here is cpu uh, 8 that is your core and here is a uh, cpu 10 that is your core cpu 12 this is your core and cpu 14 this is also your core and the remaining which i left that is your thread of your cpu so now what you need to do guys you need to go for 
any of the cpu just leave this first cpu core that is cpu 0 just simply leave this box then you need to go uh, for cpu 4 or guys go for the cpu 10 or go for the cpu 8 whatever you want you can guys select any of these i will go with the cpu 10 i will check my here then click here on this ok button and we are just guys changing the priority of our cpu from 0 to our cpu 10 therefore guys we can reduce the input delay and boost our fps so guys here you will again go to this kind of the error which is the registry value for affinity math as unexpected type so guys simply forget it click ok and here it will ask you for restarting your pc so once you click yes so it will restart your gpu and guys after that your screen will go black for a few seconds and then that will be fine again so let me just restart my gpu so guys here my gpu is successfully restarted you can check it out here device successfully restarted now you need to click here on this ok button click ok and simply close out the software from your pc so guys once you're done now you need to simply close out it and now here is the final step and that is also the most important one now you need to simply guys monitor your latency uh, mode so guys here you can check it out here uh, the current value of the highest myriad interrupt to process latency so you need now simply one time refresh it simply close out this monitor option then click start monitor again and there guys uh, you can now check it out here the highest interrupt to process latency this is your uh, latency of your mouse and keyboard and also your game latency and guys also another benefit of the software you will guys go here into the stats option and there you can guys check it out here which process is getting a lot of guys your resources you can simply uninstall that or simply close out that specific program for increasing the performance of your pc like for example here is our hard page fall so you need to click here on this option so here you can check it out here obs is getting right now the more performance or the resources of my pc because i'm recording right now with that then go for this driver option click here on to this high expectation simply click here and there you can also find out here my these driver are getting a lot of resources of my computer guys if if you any of your driver is getting a lot of your resources simply guys check that simply update your dad driver and guys by doing that you can get insane performance out of your pc so guys i hope so you love this video and this will guys really help you to boosting your pc performance so please make sure to subscribe turn on the bell notification leave a like on this video so till the next video peace out